Good morning. I'm Jason Laird. Thanks for choosing us to help you wake up right. Check out where these temperatures are right now already, breaking that freezing degree mark into Canyon City at 32. Mid 20s into the springs right now, low 20s down into Pueblo, but really we're looking absolutely gorgeous. High to mid 20s out into our eastern portions of the state, and it is going to be a nice one today. Those temperatures finally starting to feel a little bit more like what they should be for this time of the year. Check out the HD Doppler. Not a whole lot of activity going on right now. Clear skies out there and no moisture to speak of. We've got a big area of high pressure that's built over the Four Corners region that is directing all that moisture well to our north. Or what moisture is moving in off of the Pacific coast and also keeping all that cold air to our north. Now, it's not going to last forever. We're going to see a little dip into this weekend. So, here's how things are going to play out. There's that area of high pressure basically creating a big ridge in the jet stream. Again, that's holding all that cold air well to our north. But as the weekend approaches, we're going to start to see a weak little dip in the jet stream. That's going to allow for some cooler air to start sliding into the state as the weekend approaches. And not even crazy cool. We're still going to stay fairly warm this weekend. And mild, especially compared to what we've had. But it is going to dip those temperatures down slightly and increase the cloud cover as we move into Saturday and Sunday. So just a little bit of a cool down this weekend compared to where we're looking today. But check out those temperatures or where we're expected to hit today, I should say. 49 degrees we should peak out at here into the springs. Here into Pueblo, 52. The 50s consistently out into eastern Colorado. Even a few 50s into the high terrain, 51 degrees into Salida there. Leadville, about the only chilly spot at 30. As for lows tonight, cooling off into the 20s, pretty much all across the board. A few teens out there, but fairly comfortable. And those clear skies are going to make for a bit of a chilly night tonight. Over the next seven, again, mild weekend. We'll see a little dip in those temperatures. Not drastic, though. But then check out the temperatures for next week. Warming back up to the high 50s, pushing the 60s by Wednesday. It's going to be absolutely gorgeous. Might hit some golf this next week. Pueblo, 52 degrees to uh, kick off our weekend today. Then the 51 degree mark for the weekend. A few clouds moving in, nothing too crazy. Temperatures warming back up to the 60s for next week. Into Canyon City, 54 degrees for our TGI Friday. Then 52 and 50 degrees by Sunday. Again, just that little hiccup in the temperatures. Nothing too crazy. 60s, though, by Tuesday and pretty much lasting up through the rest of the weekend. Teller County, plenty of sunshine to go around today. 47 degrees. We're going to see those temperatures warm up rather quickly today as we're not expecting hardly a cloud in the sky. And then back up to the 50s into the mountains by next Tuesday. Looking absolutely gorgeous. It's going to feel like a heat wave. It's crazy to think 50s and 60s. Are going to feel like a heat wave, but compared to the sub zero temperatures we've had, it's going to be a nice change. And all the moisture we've had, the uh, golf courses should start oh. to green up nicely. Oh, totally, totally. As long as it's not that slushy kind of muck where you can't <laughs> drive, the, drive the carts around, we'll be in good shape. Oh, Jason, <laughs> you got to walk, man. Yeah, I should, but. You right. don't walk, do you? Uh, every chance I get. <laughs> all right, all right. Fine. thanks, Jason. <laughs> yep. Six passengers.